Here's a fun question from uh, YouTube user Chopped Liver 99. Chopped Liver asks, all right, how about this? For a segment or two, forget politics. Talk about the shows and movies you've watched with your family, just so you can take a break from politics for a minute or two. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for, for, you know, letting me talk about things that I like. I don't know if y'all are going to like them, <laughs> but let's talk. Um, and you want to talk about movies and TV shows that I like uh, and that I watch with my family. Uh, we're a Marvel family. Like it's not, I'm a Marvel fan. We're a Marvel family. And I know that's frowned upon. That's not cinema. Blah, 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 blah. No, but you know what? It's fun for kids. It's fun for fun for adults who like to still think that they're kids. It allows me to actually shut my brain off and not have to think about how horrible the rest of the world is. It's an escape as cinema is supposed to be. I don't care if it's not masterpieces, you know, like these aren't going to go into the annals of film history, like gone with the wind and citizen Kane. I don't care. I don't care. I enjoy them. It's fun. And it helps me relax. And there's nothing wrong with that. I don't ever begrudge people for what they choose to consume in terms of media, uh, news media. Yeah. I'll judge you all day for that. <laughs> but what you do for enjoyment or entertainment, that's your thing. Don't let anybody make you feel bad about it. It pisses me off when I see these people on social media, these uh, acting all elite, like I only watch films that shut the f, f up. Okay. Let people enjoy what they enjoy. I also occasionally enjoy a good little trashy reality show. Not just any of them though. Like a lot of people across the country during the pandemic, I got hooked on 90 day fiance. And of course now all the 90 day fiance spinoffs. Um, it's stupid. It is so horrible, but I love it. <laughs> I genuinely do. It's fun. So, you know, that's, that's a good escape for me too. Looking at how weird other people's lives are. It's like, you know what? Maybe my family's not so messed up. Um, so those are two things I, I do really enjoy it. You know, anything Marvel, um, and DC, right? I'm not an exclusive Marvel, not DC. I like comic book movies. You know, I, I, I enjoy it and, and I don't care if other people think, well, that's just garbage TV. Good. I like garbage. That's a weird thing to say. Um, another thing, and, and we're going to find this out here in just a few uh, uh, weeks, really at this point, football, I'm a big football guy college football, pro football, doesn't matter. Love it. I'll watch it. I don't care who's playing. I'm going to sit and watch that game and I'm going to be hundred percent into it. Already got tickets by the way, to a, a football game this upcoming season, a black Friday game. So that's going to be fun. Uh, might even go to a Las Vegas Raiders game because I have a business trip in Las Vegas that happens to coincide with the Raiders playing Monday night football against the Packers. That's my wife's family's team. So I don't know that I can not go to that. So when football season comes, like pfft, all the other shows, movies, TV, all that gets pushed aside. It's football time. That's what it is. Um, and those are the things I do to relax. Uh, I've also started getting into reading. I know it's a weird thing to say, but, um, actually David Pakman did, a uh, 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 a video recently where he talked about how he reads a lot. And he says, you know, it's just a great way to basically, you know, if I'm reading a lot and the other person is not, then that gives me knowledge that they don't have. And that like, that kind of struck at me like, Oh crap. Cause I used to read as part of my job as, as a researcher, I would read a book or two a week and I haven't been doing that. So I'm trying to get back into that habit of doing that constantly uh, just to up my knowledge about everything. So that's great. And, you know, David Pakman inspired me to do that again. Uh, but other than that, I'm going to be watching some horrible movies with trashy TV on the side. So thank you for your question. It is nice to occasionally not have to talk about politics. Hey everyone, this is Aspen. And did you know that for the low, low cost of $0 per day, you can subscribe to the fair and balanced YouTube channel. We also encourage you to like comment and share, but again, click that subscribe button and help Aspen. Oh, not be so grumpy.